Hey guys, welcome back to 60 Seconds on Romexa 6. I'm flying solo today. Uh, we had a question about how do we export DICOMs as STL files? So here we have a little case that we have a six-year-old girl who has a fused left condyle to our articular eminence and can't open her mouth. So we need to print this model to look at it. So we'll go up to File, Export as STL File, um, and then immediately it's gonna reset the threshold of the 3D model. So you're gonna see some scatter. So the first thing that you're gonna do is pick a location on your hard drive that you wanna save the case at and then start adjusting your threshold. It's critical that you go back and readjust your threshold in your 3D viewer by altering that up arrow there. And then whatever you see on the screen is what you're gonna get in your STL file when you save it. So here we can see that's the, the file that we received back from Romexis and literally five seconds, it's gonna fire this thing out. We get 3D printed and go ahead and look at the model. It's amazing what you could do with this technology.